Good morning. So most of you know I've been working on the uh, the car, um, my Fursita Wagen, a hot rod um, built 911 Carrera. So uh, I'm going to give you a quick update, video update. I have uh, gone about as far as I can uh, waiting on a couple of parts to come in, which I'm hoping will come in uh, next week. So uh, for a quick tour. <clears throat> All right, so uh, I think you can see most of that. I have uh, gotten in the uh, vacuum manifold, and that's roughly plumbed so that it's going to both the um, the uh, fuel regulator, pressure regulator for the fuel system, and it goes around to a little sensor. It's called a MAP sensor. I've gotten the oil hoses rerouted, so oil hose to the um, oil hose breather. Uh, the 911 has just an ocean of oil in it, so it, bre it has two breathers on it. One goes to the crankcase, which is that line, and the other goes to that breather just in case. Or in hard cornering. So um, I've also installed the new spark plugs. You can kind of see these uh, um, uh, coil on plug. Um, um, parts. So instead of having a distributor, uh, the coils on top of each plug. So there's six of them. And you see them over here. They don't have the the cables on them yet. Um, I've also installed on the old distributor the uh, engine position module. So that that's basically a sensor that will tell the computer uh, a lot of things, including crank and um, camshaft uh, location that's really the timing for the whole for the whole thing um, outside of that you can probably tell for some of you that so that's where basically the the um, uh, throttle bodies will go the individual throttle bodies previously that was a just a full uh, plenum or you know one ma air manifold with a single throttle body on it over here all the almost all the, the collection of parts that are going to be for sale once I clean them up. Some of them are not sellable, but uh, most of them are. And uh, this right here is the old uh, intake. So that's the, uh, the, the plenum. I guess it's not a common, that's kind of a common plenum. Maybe they call it a split plenum. Um, with a bank for the left and the right, throttle body right in the middle, all kinds of vacuum hoses, etc., etc. And then, oops, sorry to get back in that way. Let's come around this way. I've uh, done some work to get the all the old CPU out. So the old CPU or ECU, the engine control unit, used to sit in there. Um, <clears throat> this was a relay called the DME uh, for the old computer. What I've done is I've repurposed it so that I can pull uh, ignition or switched 12 volt power off of it as well as uh, drive a line to the tack and uh, to the fuel pump. And then that wires itself all the way back around over to that and lots of other wires too. So that is the um, uh, from Rasant. Um, they've pulled together a, a wiring harness specific to the Porsche leveraging the AEM Infinity ECU. It's got a uh, Busman um, relay and fuse panel they're kind of on the little the left hand side of that. I'm not quite done obviously getting all the carpet back in but that'll look really good when it's finished. Obviously it makes that that uh, uh, passenger side rear seat not very available but uh, we only have one other little passenger and she will sit there once I get all the seat you know the carpet and the seat put back in the seat by the way is just a little pad <laughs> that sits down there and she's getting close to not being quite big enough to ride in the back seat anyway so uh, so anyway <clears throat> that is the uh, current state of the build for the Fursita wagon uh, and we'll be uh, doing more once I get more parts in.
Maybe I'll do another live video. All right.